Hello everyone. Welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. In today's video, we will be discussing about drug calculation of dobutamine and dopamine with examples like if the order is given in mcg per kilogram per minute, then how do we proceed with the calculations? Before getting into the session, if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Let's get into the topic. Injection dobutamine comes under the drug class inotropic agents. If the order is given in microgram per kilogram per minute, then we must remember the formula desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time in minutes multiplied by body weight in kilogram divided by available dose multiplied by thousand which gives ml per hour. When we are applying this formula in the subsequent examples, you will have a clear idea of doing this calculation. Now, let's discuss about converting LB, that is pound, to kilogram. Why? Because, as we have discussed in the formula previously, weight should be expressed in kilogram. So, how do we convert this? LB divided by 2.2 gives the kilogram. That is, 1 kilogram equals 2.2 LB. For example, converting 180 LB. 180 LB equal to how many kilograms? 180 divided by 2.2 gives 81.8 kilogram. That is, we can round it up and say it is 82 kilogram. Let's get into the example 1. Order is dobutamine 2.5 microgram per kg per minute for a client who weighs 80 kg. Available doses dobutamine 250 mg in 250 ml D5 water. Calculate the weight. Now the formula will be desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time in minutes multiplied by body weight divided by available dose multiplied by 1000. Here, the desired dose is 2.5, quantity will be 250, time in minutes will be 60, body weight is 80. Here, we do not need any conversion for body weight because it is given in kilogram. Available dose is 250. Applying all into the formula, we get the answer 12 ml per hour. So, the rate of infusion for this calculation is 12 ml per hour. Let's get into the second example. Order is dobutamine 250 mg in 250 ml D5 water per IV to infuse at 5 microgram per kg per minute. The client weight is 185 lbs. Calculate the flow rate using infusion pump. The formula is Desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time in minutes multiplied by body weight divided by available dose multiplied by 1000. Here, desired dose is 5, quantity is 250, time in minutes is 60. Body weight is 185 LBs. Hence, we need to convert it into kilogram. So, as per the formula, 185 divided by 2.2 which gives 84 kilogram. And the available dose is 250. Applying all into the formula, we get the answer 25.2 ml per hour. Hence, the rate of infusion for this calculation will be 25.2 ml per hour. Next example, order is a 70 kg patient is currently receiving dobutamine at a rate of 8 microgram per kg per minute. Available dose is dobutamine 250 mg in 50 ml D5 water. Calculate the rate. The formula is desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time in minutes multiplied by body weight divided by available dose multiplied by 1000. Here, the desired dose is 8 quantity is 50, time in minutes is 60, body weight is 70 kg, available dose is 250. Applying all into the formula, 
we get the answer 6.72 ml per hour. Hence, the rate of infusion for this calculation will be 6.72 ml per hour. Now, let's discuss about calculation of injection dopamine. Injection dopamine comes under the drug class inotropic agents. Looking at example 4, a patient is ordered to start an IV dopamine drip at 4 microgram per kg per minute. The patient weighs 80 kg. You have a bag of dopamine that reads 400 mg per 250 ml. What will you set the IV pump drip rate that is ml per hour at? Here the formula is desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time in minutes multiplied by body weight divided by available dose multiplied by 1000. Here the desired dose is for quantity will be 250, time in minutes is 60, body weight is 80, available dose is 400. Applying all into the formula, we get the answer 12 ml per hour. Hence, the rate of infusion for this calculation will be 12 ml per hour. Example 5. A patient is ordered to start an IV dopamine drip at 8 mcg per kg per minute. The patient weighs 126 ALBs. You have a bag of dopamine that reads 800 mg per 500 ml. What will you set the IV pump drip rate that is ml per hour at? Formula is desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time and minutes multiplied by body weight divided by available dose multiplied by 1000. Here the desired dose is 8, quantity is 500, time in minutes will be 60, body weight is given in 126 LBs which we have to convert to kilogram. Hence body weight is 126 divided by 2.2 which gives 57.2 kilogram and we can round it and keep it as 57 kilogram. Available dose is 800. So applying all into the formula, we get the answer 17.1 ml per hour. Hence, the rate of infusion for this calculation will be 17.1 ml per hour. Example 6. A patient is ordered to start an IV dopamine drip at 3 microgram per kg per minute. The patient weighs 60 kg. You have a bag of dopamine that reads 400 mg per 250 ml. What will you set the IV pump drip rate that is ml per hour at? The formula is desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time in minutes multiplied by body weight divided by available dose multiplied by 1000. Here the desired dose is 3, quantity is 250, time in minutes will be 60, body weight is 60 kg, available dose is 400. Applying all into the formula, we get the answer 6. 7 ml per hour. So the rate of infusion for this calculation will be 6.7 ml per hour. Here you go with calculation of injection dobutamine and injection dopamine. Now here are a few examples for your practice. Read the questions carefully and do the calculations. Mention your answers in the comment section. If you find this video useful, please like it and please subscribe it and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.